got sold for 16 million quid. Yes. <laughs> Honestly. Yeah. Who? I want to know who bought I that. I shredded a piece of paper to say, I'll sell you this if you like. <laughs> <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> Thanks, Roger. I'd buy that for a fiver. No. Uh, now, lightning strikes. We've had quite a lot of instability last night, particularly overnight in the uh, on the Isle of Man. So it did make for some really incredible photographs. Thanks, Mike, to sending that in. But quite scary scenes, actually. Fire crews were sent out to all different parts across the Isle of Man. Thankfully... Although the pictures are very dramatic, uh, no damage was caused. And as we head through tonight, there won't be any thunderstorms. Possibly tomorrow, but not tonight. In fact, for most of us, after that rain that was quite heavy for a lot of the time today, it did clear off and behind it we've got a fair bit of cloud but some clear spells. Now, that's going to lead to some mist, some fog patches forming, some low clouds are quite murky for some in the morning, but mild, 9 or 10, 11 degrees. Now, we should be around 6 or 7 We've got a lot of mild air that's going to stay with us over the next few days. I'll tell you a bit more on that in a minute. Tomorrow, unsettled. We start off dry on the Isle of Man, but then we'll start to get some showers coming through. And that is the scene across all parts as we head through tomorrow. A fine start, a bit misty and murky. Showers start to develop or longer spells of rain. Could be quite heavy at times and you could get some uh, thunder and lightning strikes from those as well. Now, temperature-wise, about 16 or 17 degrees. We hold on to that mild air, but the winds will start to strengthen. They're going to pick up. And that's ahead of this area of low pressure. Now, this is spiralling warm air around it, blowing up our way. It's coming up from France, from Spain, from Portugal. That's the reason that we've got mild air. No Arctic air with us at the minute. So Saturday, all being well, a lot of us will be dry and fine and should feel quite pleasant. But there will be a front across more northern parts. How far north or south? That's what we're keeping an eye on. So I'll keep you up to date as and when we get it. Temperature-wise, though, 17, maybe even 18 degrees for the end of October. Keep the heating off for a bit longer. Turn it off. Absolutely, yeah. hasn't been on yet. Jim will be delighted. Yeah, although when the Arctic air arrives, I suspect we'll all <laughs> stop feeling quite so complacent. Oh, no. Thanks so much.